Hey guys, today I'm going to show you some simple everyday things I do to help support detoxification as well as reduce my toxic load. We are bombarded with toxins every day. They're impossible to avoid in this modern world we live in. Things such as air pollution, tap water, food additives, chemicals in personal products and household cleaners, endocrine disrupting chemicals and plastic products, synthetic fragrances and synthetic clothing, use of medications, herbicides and pesticides in our food, the list goes on. These things will accumulate in our body and wreak havoc on our health if we're not detoxifying properly. So finding ways to support our detox organs and reduce our exposure in general is very important. So let's get on with this video. First up, we have exercise. Exercise will help you detoxify in more ways than one. You'll sweat out toxins through your skin. You'll breathe out toxins through the deep breathing you do. It promotes circulation and the more blood that's circulated through the body, the easier it is for the liver and lymph nodes to do their job. One of the most common obstacles for detox is the sluggish lymphatic system. Unlike the network of arteries and veins which rely on the heart to circulate blood, your lymphatic system doesn't have a pump and instead relies on muscle motion to improve circulation. So the less you move, the more waste you accumulate. And one of the best ways to stimulate the lymphatic system is by jumping on a rebounder, aka a mini trampoline. Although I don't own one myself, so I just stick to doing my jumping. I love a good squat jump. But really any movement, even walking, will help get your lymph flowing. And you know what? Once a day, just put on a really good song, get a bit wild, dance around, and get that lymph pumping. There's also many yoga poses and stretches that can help aid in detoxification. Twists are particularly great for detoxifying. When you twist, the organs of detoxification and elimination are compressed, pushing out old blood, and then when you release the twist, fresh blood can flow in. Also, when working out, you tend to drink more water, which is essential for flushing out unwanted toxins and waste. Dehydration is a common cause of lymph congestion. Just make sure you're drinking filtered water or spring water and avoid tap water and plastic water bottles as they can add to your toxic load. Also, can we just take a minute to admire this beautiful yoga mat I recently purchased? It matches my apartment so perfectly and it makes my yoga mat look like a rug so I just leave it out all the time. My next tip to detoxify is using an infrared sauna. That being said, living in an apartment, I don't have room for a full-size sauna. However, I do have room for my infrared sauna blanket from Bond Charge. That's why Bond Charge is the perfect partner for today's video. Bond Charge makes products that adopt ancestral ways of living in our modern day world. They have a huge line of wellness products, everything from blue light blocking glasses, EMF management, circadian friendly lighting, and of course their infrared sauna blanket. Their sauna blanket works by using infrared light, which heats up the body directly rather than the air around you like a traditional sauna. This means you can get the same benefits at a lower heat. Infrared saunas help you detoxify from heavy metals and other toxins. It increases the heart rate, which can help burn calories. It helps you recover faster, and it's just really nice to unwind and de-stress. The Bond Charge Sauna Blanket is designed in Australia and is super easy to use. It takes less than a minute to set up, heats up really quickly, you use it for 30 to 40 minutes while you read, watch YouTube, or simply just lay there. And when you're done, you just wipe the inside with a damp cloth and put it back in the carrying case for easy storage. And it's also very low EMF compared to other sauna blankets. Bond Charge has quick worldwide shipping, easy returns and exchanges, and a 12 month warranty. So you can click the link in the description box and use the discount code SARAHN for 15% off. Using herbs is another very effective way to gently detox. Nature is basically a natural apothecary of plants that can help support our organs. You can cook with herbs or you can use them in the form of tinctures, teas, and supplements. Some of the best herbs to detoxify are burdock root, milk thistle, stinging nettle, dandelion, turmeric root, red clover, and cilantro to name a few. Another great way to support daily detoxification is dry brushing. Our skin is our body's largest organ and it plays a huge role in detoxification. 
Dry brushing is the ancient practice of brushing dry skin with a natural bristle brush in order to stimulate the lymphatic system and exfoliate your skin. Start at your feet and brush upwards towards your heart. Some other reported benefits of dry brushing on a regular basis are cellulite reduction, clear skin, and a short-term energy boost. And speaking of showering, cold hot contrast therapy is another great way to help support detoxification. Lymphatic vessels contract when exposed to cold and dilate in response to heat. So after dry brushing, have a shower and alternate back and forth between hot and cold water, and this will help move stagnant lymphatic fluid through your lymphatic system. I'm all about reducing the toxic load in my living space since I love spending most of my time at home. Houseplants not only bring incredible beauty to your living space, but certain plants can also help clean the air from things like mold, pollutants, and chemicals like formaldehyde and benzene, all while returning oxygen to the room. Think of houseplants as nature's air purifiers. I love low maintenance plants like snake plants, CZ plants, pothos, things that don't require much light and watering. So add a little bit of greenery to your home and enjoy cleaner air. And on the topic of reducing our toxic load, some things I recommend and do are eat organic whole foods instead of processed foods. Clean eating will make it so much easier for your body to detox naturally. Choose carpets, couches, and mattresses that don't emit VOCs. I love my birch mattress because it's completely non-toxic and I don't have to worry about chemical off-gassing. Use non-toxic household cleaners. Things like baking soda and vinegar can take care of a lot of your cleaning needs. And I love using my Jude's Miracle Cloth for the majority of my cleaning. I will link it down below because this little cloth is a game changer. Avoid using Teflon and other non-stick cookware. Instead, I opt for stainless steel or cast iron cookware and they also last a lot longer. I always choose glass over plastic because plastic contains endocrine disrupting chemicals such as BPA. Some common sources of BPA you may not be aware of are printed receipts and even clothing made from synthetic materials like polyester. So try to opt for email receipts and choose natural materials for clothing such as linen, cotton, silk, and wool. And also be aware that products labeled as BPA-free usually contain substitutes, which have just as much of a hormonal effect on us. Just like we don't want to be drinking tap water, we don't want to bathe in it either. I recommend installing a shower filter that reduces chlorine or chloramine. Just look up what your water is chemically treated with in your area. And if you're taking a bath, you can add a teaspoon of vitamin C powder to dechlorinate the water. I also highly suggest you use an air purifier with a HEPA filter, address mold issues, dust regularly, and try to air your home out as much as possible to allow fresh air to move through your living space. Switch out chemical-filled air fresheners with essential oils, and choose pure beeswax candles instead of candles with synthetic fragrance. And of course, I recommend you use non-toxic personal hygiene products, skincare, cosmetics, hair care, and sunscreen. Believe it or not, but our skin absorbs what we put on it, so what you're applying to your skin is more than likely getting inside your body. It's important to pay close attention to the ingredients in our skincare products. Colors, fragrances, parabens, phthalates, so many things that we can avoid and women in particular at least myself love using their skincare and cosmetics but luckily there are so many amazing non-toxic natural beauty brands out there my favorite clean beauty brand is definitely blue beautifly i have been using their products for years and they are just the best and i do have a discount code for blue beautifly so check the description box for the latest code i have and on the topic of natural skincare and beauty products, if you're looking to detoxify your skin, Mother Nature has your answer, and that is clay. There are so many different clays that are beneficial for your skin, so choose one that works for your skin type. If I'm experiencing acne, I choose a clay like bentonite. However, lately I've been really enjoying Rasool clay. It's a mineral rich, gentle clay that works as a cleanser while detoxifying the skin and clarifying the hair. Here I'm mixing a bit of nettle tea with the clay and to use it in my hair, I put it in a squeeze bottle and then add a little bit of extra water or tea to get it more of a liquid consistency for easy application. And then I apply that to my scalp and hair, really focusing on the roots. It can help scalp conditions and really help clarify the hair. 
And then for the skin, I make it a thicker consistency and apply it all over my face, neck and chest or your entire body if you want. And you can use this as an exfoliating cleanser or a face mask. I just leave the clay on for 10 to 15 minutes and then I wash it off in the shower. And you can use a clay mask around once a week. I wouldn't do it too, too often. Some people use the clay straight up as their shampoo, but I find that I need to shampoo my hair again after using it just to get any powdery residue off. So those are some simple ways you can support daily detoxification to keep your body as healthy as possible. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!